a blood-sucking evil old woman who sheds her skin at night, and morphs into what can only be described as an UFO. This is the amazing legend of the Sukuyant, a malevolent shape-shifting female spirit part of Caribbean lore, who has been terrifying residents of the region for over 400 years. If you enjoy digging into the mysteries, folklore and legends of the Americas please take a second to like and subscribe as it really helps the channel. The Caribbean is a melting pot of so many different cultures, having African, European and Native American influences strongly present. The legend of the Sukuyant can be traced back to Africa where there are stories of similar creatures in many cultures, strongly supporting the idea that the lore originated on the continent and persisted when Caribbean ancestors were enslaved and transported to the islands. The Sukuyant is considered to be a jumbi, which is a common entity in the folklore of the entire Caribbean. A jumbi is used to describe malevolent entities of all different sorts, and the Sukuyant is a type of jumbi that is known to be a shapeshifter and a bloodsucker. Also called the Lagaru woman in certain areas, the Sukuyant appears as an old haggard lady who sheds her skin at night, hides it in a mortar and transforms into a fiery orb that hunts people down and sucks their blood, sometimes killing them, sometimes turning her victims into a Sukuyant themselves. It is said that when the Lagaru woman takes on the shape of a bright fiery orb, in what can literally only be described as an UFO, she is almost unstoppable, able to sneak into buildings through small crevices like keyholes. So what does one do if a Sukuyant is on the prowl and they happen upon its path? Well first, you need to know a Sukuyant is nearby and not die at her hands. It is said that you can surround your home with grains of rice, which a Sukuyant feels a compulsion to count, and will have to painstakingly pick up one grain at a time before she can enter your home. This same tactic is said to work on many vampire-like creatures. If you manage the not dying part, you need to track down where she has cast aside her skin, throw coarse salt in the mortar where she hid it, and she will no longer be able to put it back on, therefore perishing. It is further said that if one manages to find its skin and kill a Sukuyant, one should keep it, because it is known to possess great magical powers. If you guys haven't already please don't forget to like and subscribe as it really helps out the channel. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for the next video.